Hi folks, Tim here with a real quick uh, tutorial video to show how it's um, possible to colour in a sort of flat shaded model like this um, very simply and quickly without any sort of Photoshop skills whatsoever. Um, so uh, this is Unity um, to show um, what the model looks like. Um, just a nice little sort of uh, jet fighter based on the X29. Um, and if I pop over to Blender, this is the, the same model um, as created in Blender. And what I typically do is um, go up to the little uh, button up here, click UV editing, so you get the uh, the UV panel on the side. Um, I go to the uh, shading and UVs tab here, unwrap. In fact, what I need to do first is to select the whole thing. Go to unwrap, um, smart UV project, defaults are fine, and it pops everything up onto the um, UV plane like that. Um, now, usually, what you'd do at this stage is you'd open a um, an image um, to uh, to map onto your um, UV plane here. So, what I will do is go up to um, my folder structure, find a simple color palette which I've prepared earlier. You see, it's um, literally just a screen grab of the uh, the Windows uh, color picker. Um, it can be any color palette you like; um, doesn't really matter. And um, what I'll do at the moment is um, I'll hit G. Um, and grab all of this lot. Whoops. Uh, select all. G. No. Select all. G. Move it all off to the side. There we go. Um, and then I will um, scale the whole lot right down to uh, so that it's uh, basically a point. I'll then move everything over to the color that I'm interested in. So I'm actually going to make it a sort of yeah, just an off-white there and that basically gives every single one of these faces that color but if I don't want all of those um, faces to be um, to be white so for example I want the cockpit to be a slightly different color what I'm going to do is I'm going to select a few of these faces like that now these are going to be the only ones um, selected here and if, then if I hit G again and I can move those over, let's say put those on black. So if I then select everything on the model, you'll see I've got now two zones. All of the white ones are here, all of the black ones are here. And what that should mean is that um, all of the body of the plane should end up as white and the few faces that I selected to be black and put on this square here should end up as black. So all I need to do is save that, pop back over to Unity, and there you go. Um, and because I had the mirror modifier set on the uh, the Blender model, you can see that it's uh, it's mirrored those faces on both sides. Um, so that's all there is to it. Um, I could continue, obviously, um, mapping out different uh, parts of the the plane to different colors, but uh, that's the uh, the basics. Um, and before I uh, before I disappear, I will just show you how I prepared this um, uh, uh, material. It's literally just the the same texture that I selected before, the color palette texture on a basic material, and just dropped it onto the um, mesh renderer for the model itself. So there you go. Very simple. Very quick. Uh, no artistic skills required apart from selecting a few faces to uh, to give the right colour. Um, I hope you found that useful um, and uh, I will have more tutorial videos for you soon. Thank you very much.